Hey guys, uh, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to do my November favourites. Um, I haven't actually done a favourites before, so I do hope you enjoy it and let's get on with the video. Okay, so the first lot of items I'm going to do are beauty products. And the first thing I've been loving is this. Now this is the Zoella Snowella body mist and it's the 100ml and look it has a pom pom on it this is just the most adorable thing actually i'm gonna spray a bit right now amazing i love it and it's got a copper lid like what more do you want this would be a great either stocking filler or present yeah i love this so much big ups to zoe on that because it's amazing my next favorite is actually from lush now this is my second one of these already and this is a luxury lush put this is one of my all-time favorites along with the golden wonder which i now have heard that they do a giant one so i really want one of those and this i'm gonna get it out but i'm gonna get pink everywhere it's kind of broken but it looks like this oh my god and it smells amazing i put a video of this on my musically which i'll leave in the down bar you should all go follow me um, so yeah, that is the Lux. I have a second favourite from Lush, which is the Twilight Body Spray, 200ml. Now, I've used quite a lot of this. It smells so good. I even sometimes use it as a room spray because it just makes the room smell like the Lush shop. And it is £20, which is quite a lot of money. But I think it's so worth it. Plus it's 200ml and it smells Amazing. To the more makeup items, the first thing I've been loving is the MAC Prep and Prime Fix Plus, which looks like this, and I'm practically out. Um, I love this. I love this for priming my face, setting my face, and also I use it for making eyeshadows more pigmented, like glittery eyeshadows, and it works so well. I cannot wait to get more of this. Um, I'm trying to save that every last drop so I don't have to buy a new one. But um, I do really, really, really love this and highly recommend the MAC Prep and Prime. Wait for the guinea pigs in the background. They just want my next favourite is also from MAC and it's the Matte Lipstick in Whirl. I've got it on right now. Um, normally I prefer a berry tone in a winter and autumn, but I quite like this shade because it's quite dark brown and I feel like it suits me quite well. Um, and goes with my hair also. Also like Rebel from MAC, which I do have, but it's over there. Um, so yeah, the MAC lipsticks are some of my favourites and I really like them. Uh, my next favourite is from NYX, which is a brand that I really, really love. I don't have much from there, but what I do have, I do love. And this is the NYX Lingerie Eye Tint in the shade... Does it have a shade? Oh, Lidl. Lid, Lid Light? Lid Light? Something like that. That there. And it's number number one and it's like a copper rose gold shade I've got it on right now if you can see and this is so easy if you don't have the time to do the blendy thing which most of the time I don't um, then this is so easy and I don't think they're that expensive and it's a gorgeous color for this time of year as well so yeah go check these out um, NYX is a brilliant brand I think they're so underrated because their stuff is so good okay so next is foundation and the foundation that I've been loving for a really really long time is the L'Oreal infallible total cover now this stuff is amazing I've got it on today um, I've been through I think three or four of these and I'm already nearly out on this one so I've already got a backup because I know that I love it so much and also to go with that I have the L'Oreal Infallible Mattifying Base. Now I don't have this on today, um, I actually forgot to put it on, <laughs> but this primer is amazing. If you haven't tried these together, then where have you been? <laughs> because honestly, this changed my makeup game. This makes my makeup stay on so well, this one, not this one, um, and this foundation just gives you an amazing base. I think this is £8, I think this might be £8 as well. And a lot of the time they're on 3 Okay, so next favourites are TV and films. Now, I don't really have any TV series that I've been watching, so we'll skip the TV series. Um, but films, obviously, these two. If you haven't watched Elf or After Christmas, then you are seriously missing out. These two films are the best Christmas films you will ever watch. Elf is just hilarious. The escalator bit makes me laugh every time even though i've seen it about 500 times i still 
laugh out loud literally after christmas is so lovely and probably a good one to watch on christmas eve especially if you have children and the other film i've been loving which isn't christmas eve but i still love it is beauty and the beast now you know me you know that i will love emma watson she is such a good actor and such a lovely person and in this she is amazing and you should go watch it they are my favorite films at the moment i have many more like i like boss baby i love planet earth one and two i've got that right here actually the box set i've watched it so many times and it's so good like these people that get to film this are so lucky like that what your favorites are in the so, uh, comment my next favorites are youtubers that i've been watching now i watch a lot of youtube and I have quite a few favourites, so I'm just going to tell you my top 10, depending on how many I can think of. So firstly is Life as Eleanor, um, then Thatcher Joe, Zoella, Tanya Burr, Bella Bambina XX, um, who else do I watch? Ollie White, Mikey, Jack Maynard, Connor Maynard in the fro, loads of YouTubers. Basically any youtuber you will know i will watch and i will link all my favorites in the down bar easy so yeah i will link them all in the down bar and please go and check them out because they're all amazing i mean you probably already do but if you don't um, go another check them thing out. from zoella beauty which i forgot to mention earlier is the winter wonder hand hand cream which i have been loving it doesn't look like i need much but i have um i love the packaging for one and it's so nice Oh, hiccup <laughs> it's so nice and so thick as you can see and it's so good I think it's like five pound fifty or something my next favorite is actually from Tony and Guy and it's the Tony and Guy sky high volume dry shampoo now I've nearly used a whole thing of this this is amazing if you just need a little you know zhuzh up of your hair because you've left it a bit too long um, this is perfect and I don't think it's that expensive um, and Tony and Guy is such a good hair brand I like okay so my last favorite for this month is actually a skincare item which is the Neutrogena Hydro Boost Cleanser Water Gel that was an asshole <laughs> this stuff is insane um, I love Neutrogena as a brand their skincare is incredible and this again is no exception um, this just makes my skin feel fresh and really nice and hydrated and honestly if you haven't tried this you need to try it I, again I don't think it's that expensive and Neutrogena is such a good brand so yeah end of my November favorites I do hope you enjoyed the video please give it a thumbs up and subscribe and I will see you in my next video also I forgot to add I'm vlogging today so that will be up either today as well or tomorrow so yeah Stay tuned. Bye guys. And oh, you should get yours now in Boots or Superdrug. Hashtag not an ad. Oh, I talk for way too long. Like, seriously, I have to be done by 11 and I'm still filming. Sorry, Nan, if you're watching. <laughs>